this would be you, that would be V. All right, so to find the derivative of Y with respect to X in this particular case here now, what you're going to have to do is use the quotient rule. Sorry, I keep going to say product rule. Right, so V by du dx minus U by dv dx, all divided by V squared. Okay, cool. So V is X squared plus 1. DU dx is just going to be 3 minus 3x minus 2. Then multiply by dv dx, which itself is 2x. All right. Uh, then that's over v squared, which is x squared plus 1. All right. If you expand the numerator, 3 by x squared gives us 3x squared. 3 by 1 is 3. Uh, 2x by 3x is 6x squared. And 2x by 2 will give us 4x. And whenever minus in the front, it's, it's going to change the sign of everything in the bracket. So it's minus 6x squared plus 4x. All right, and again, that's all over x squared plus 1. So, of course, 3x squared minus 6x squared will give us minus 3x squared. Three, right? So then this plus 4x and plus 3. Nothing else could simplify. So you have a, a quadratic there, a maximum quadratic. And that's x squared plus 1. Sorry, I forgot to put the square here, here, and here. Wow. 